What is going on guys? Sid here with another Spooky Season Specials and guys it's Friday October 1st. Happy Spooky Season. Happy Spooky Season Specials. Happy Halloween. Happy unofficial you know Halloween fall. Oh my god to all the leafers out there. Guys what's up? What it do? What's going on? Guys um so we're back again and we're in night number three now in Five Nights at Freddy's part two right and night number three is when the difficulty starts getting amped up even more than before and as you guys saw I got up to 5 a.m. on one go and then uh, the animatronic actually pulled my camera down and then it took me by surprise and then I didn't drop my mask fast enough so guys we're playing Five Nights at Freddy's uh, and we're in night three Five Nights at Freddy's 2 and we're in night three right and I don't want to take away from the suspense and the thrills right but um guys there's a lot of repetitive motion that i had to learn in order to surpass in order to pass night three right um now what what's really different right um from nights one and nights two is that you have to go in with a set strategy right and again i had to in, in this night I had to start looking at walkthroughs, right, from a couple of different YouTube users, right, that specialize in Five Nights at Freddy's, right? So I guess there's like a competitive scene for this game for FNAF, right, or however they pronounce it, right? But there's a competitive scene, and this game has so many damn sequels, right? Um, but apparently this is the most monotonous and the most repetitive of the series, right? Um, and you kind of feel that in game, right? Um, you have to switch from the camera, right? Um, you have to switch from the camera uh, to wind up the box and then you have to drop the mask immediately from the security camera like it just has to come naturally right and then you have to just anticipate someone walking into the office right so uh, one of the animatronics walking into the office so um, with that being said I want to just flat out say something uh, in the voicemail that the boss leaves you right or the supervisor or whoever the manager is right um, the voicemail that they leave you it's not listed here because this is like my fifth go around on, on night three right so um, he's kind of like downplaying the, ser the severity of the animatronics. Have you guys realized that? Like, um, this guy, somebody needs to take like serious legal action against him, right? I mean, in this in this universe, right? Because this is just absolutely ridiculous, right? He's like, oh, did uh, he's like, uh, oh, did uh, Foxy come into your room? Did, did guys, guys, Foxy, uh, Freddy, Bonnie, all all the old school animatronics that 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 cause major chaos and little that little bubble character bubble boy i think he's called or something like that um he kind of just like blocks you from from flashing your light at one point right like if he enters your room right you have to drop your mask extremely fast right uh when he appears he usually appears on the left bend uh from what i've, I've noticed but you have to drop your mask extremely fast and hope hopefully he just crawls back into the vent but guys um night number three was really tough for me for some reason right it wasn't a matter of reflex it was kind of like timing the animations if that makes any sense to you you have to really time the animations without the timing uh even if you have hyper sharp reflexes if you don't know when to time your reflexes right um based on how the animatronics move in game uh you're just not gonna be you're gonna be lucked out so foxy takes five flashes right apparently he takes five i do like seven seven for safe measure right and you have to hold it for like like a little under half a second right so it has to be like a long a long you know a long five flashes right five to seven flashes i do seven right just just in case i i i, I accidentally don't flash the light like how the hell were we supposed to figure out right this obviously the guys who do the walkthroughs on youtube uh for the pc version right um these guys really had to just you know learn these things little by little and step by step right so yeah there's like the first like like example of why you have to drop your mask as soon as you come off the security camera right it has to be ingrained you have to learn that 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 skill move you have to learn it 
right? Just like in FIFA, how you have skill moves, it's the same thing. And look, there's the other one. I think that's Chica, right? Um, I'm now learning the animatronics' names. Like, I didn't really re like. I knew they had names, but um, I didn't know that the C look. Look at the one on the left, right? On the left, then, just like I said. But as soon as I saw him, right, this little this little devil over here, right? They keep saying hi and hi. Right, I dropped it extremely fast. Like my reflexes are up, my reflexes are fired, and the responsiveness of of Five Nights at Freddy's, right, on um, uh, Part Two, is actually you know on the port on the PlayStation port, PlayStation Four slash PlayStation Five port. It's actually really good. It's it's a really good. It's really it's really really responsive, right? So what this night came down to was a little bit of luck. I want to be honest with you guys. Um. I cleared this level based on luck and what I mean when I say that is which animatronics showed up and when right um the night that I showed you guys right at the start of this video uh, was actually like a night I was clearing super super easily and then the the severity the like the the difficulty of the animatronics just coming back to back and from every angle out of nowhere like that that kind of random randomized like um timing of animatronics right really threw me off right so i felt like i should have finished night five uh night three uh at, at the 5 a.m mark right um i i think uh i should have finished the first go around at the 5 a.m mark a little cleaner right i should have finished that level but uh, it was just up to the randomness of the animatronics right so in this go i obviously got it but it took a little while it took a little while like after i got the 5 a.m right and then i died and then i had a couple of crap attempts right and we're actually gonna sh i'm actually gonna show you right some of the some of the more cooler easter eggs in the game right from dying right not really easter e well maybe yeah they're easter eggs but um, it's probably gonna be known amongst the community, right? Because they probably all see, and pr probably to you guys who are new to the game or new to the series, right? You're gonna learn, uh, you're gonna see for yourself all the cool little like death death reels, right? So yeah, that's exactly what they are. But guys, we hit 6 a.m., right? And uh, it was a really, really good run, right? Like that was an amazing run for me personally, right? And your reflexes have to be fired up. Right, and uh, the flashlight battery didn't go down, and this scene is just ridiculous. Like, what is going on here? What is going on here? Who are you seeing? Who are you seeing through the lens of what? It and, and it's like it's me. Like, I don't know what's going on. Are these animatronics possessed? Is there a demon? It's really ghoulish. It's really cool. It's got intense Chucky vibes, right? And it's so dope. And guys, I'm gonna leave you two of the death reels, right? Just so you know. So you get an idea if you are new to Five Nights at Freddy's, right? What to expect, right? So we're up to the fourth night, and that's where I cut it, right? Like, after one night, you're good, right? And you want to save for the game, right? So here we are at the the first death reel, right? And you're gonna see, like, um, like this was when like I was just getting warmed up into the game today, and I was firing up my reflexes at like uh, I think like 8 a.m., 8 9 a.m., right? Right before I got into FIFA 22, right? But I was like, hmm, can I can I get this video out to you guys? But look, there's a little bubble boy again. Just like, oh my god. So he locks me. So balloon boy, I, it's not bubble boy, balloon boy or whatever he's called, right? Um, one of the two names. Like I don't know, like I don't know Five Nights at Freddy's 2 that seriously, <laughs> but it is here for Spooky Season Specials, right? And you see just Foxy just jumps out at me. And then over here, like after I die again, right, at a separate time, look at this, you get a little Atari throwback. So you get a little bit of a nostalgia feel, right? You get these kind of like 8-bit, 8-bit graphics, right? And um, it's so cool. Like, I think that is so cool. But guys, we're at the end of the video for Spooky Season Specials for October 1st. Guys, happy Halloween, essentially, right? Um, So peace, love, all the blessings to you and yours. If you missed my... um my FIFA 22 video for today. You guys can check that out or any of the five minute boss battles. We will be returning with that series soon, right? After spooky season specials, right? Where we are in fall. So guys, subs, likes, comments, notification bell, you know the deal. Peace, love, all the blessings to you and yours. Sid.